And back. Almost done with Mass Effect, at least the first one. Whoa. And the thing I did forget about the uh, Luna mission is the specialization class, which does it, it helps a little bit. It's nothing. Oh, yeah, just just a bit. I mean, considering the way I'm playing, it's not exactly going to help too much. But if you're nice. on pistols and sniper rifles, oh. but if you're playing the way your class is meant to be played, and it probably helps. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, you sometimes use snipers once in a blue moon. <laughs> ah, yes. Stamping you. Enemies can't use biotic or tech abilities. That actually sounds useful, but meh. Yeah, that might have helped you a few other times earlier. Yeah, just 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 maybe. Just a couple more missions I can think of, and then it's forward harch until the end. I was wondering too, are, are the following games also gonna have that stupid thing where only one class can do block picking and stuff? Oh, that's done away with entirely. Good. Yeah, I know, because right? It's, it's kinda dumb, yeah. Yeah, like, come on. Message coming in. Patching it through. I received some troubling information, Commander. We need your help. Someone is killing former Alliance scientists. There have been four deaths in the past month. Former That's scientists? Sounds like someone has a project they'd like to keep secret. All four scientists worked on a classified project with coups. There was a brutal massacre there years ago. An entire unit was killed by thresher mows. It was classified as a natural hazard, but the project dates coincide with the attacks. Fun fact! The... Incident right there he mentions with the Thresher Malls, that would be Soul Survivor Shepard's background. Huh. So, all the background stuff still happens, just it depends with Shepard there. Fair enough. If I ever do end up playing the game, I guess I'll find out. If there's a extra story for that. Or rather, what the extra story for that is. Yeah, it, it's like, this is a Bioware. Of course there would be, um, extra dialogue for it. Yeah. Well, since you basically only ever play one way... <laughs> I mean, I used to play, I think, Earthborn War Hero, so I'd get a little extra different. But now, I mostly play for Mass Effect 2 and 3, so... This game yeah. stays the same all the time. Oh boy! Exogeny is involved! Oh my. <sighs> they just can't stay out of trouble, can they? Uh huh. Hmm. <sighs> it's like they were made for this shit. I haven't brought Liara out in a while. Oh, uh, yeah, not that you mentioned. <coughs> Down we go! Completely forgot about, oh, you know, the entire showcase character they use for the reveal. Oh, yeah, for the new, for Mass Effect 4. Yeah, or whatever it's supposed to be. They didn't really use a name that's like, I think. Yeah, the unofficial name's already been la listed as Mass Effect 4. Yeah, but, you know, Hopefully like, better than Andromeda. Literally the only character they showed off. It's like, completely <coughs> forgot about it. Yeah. She's also the only, um, character, aside from, uh, technically Shepard, who appears in all four released games so far. Either, oh. either in person or as a voice. Because when I was playing Andromeda a while, when it came out, I found some lo audio logs from her. Uh, I didn't know Shepard was at all in Andromeda. Uh, I don't know if Shepard has any voice appearance at all 
but when creating your character you um, select um, a, a few details about Shepard like gender and all that so you select what Shepard was like pretty much doesn't really tell me much since I never got far into Andromeda she probably has some I am mildly curious to see how things turn out in Mass Effect 4. Expect. Mm -hmm. Found our target. Yep. Who knows? Maybe after 3 we can also do Andromeda just to refund it. Yeah, that might be a thing to do. Uh, the, f the, f the funny thing is, um, uh, even in Andromeda's time, uh, which is 600 years after um, this, the, th the other three games. Liara would still be alive. She'd be, mm -hmm. she, um, re potenti and potentially Rex, uh, and a couple other characters were probably the only ones still alive. Those are human. That was a human. <laughs> it was a human. Now it's over there, over there, and over there. Let's see who these guys are. I actually haven't done this quest, so I don't know what to expect. Hmm. Mercs. Yeah, sounds like a Squish. <coughs> Wee! Get by your neck, <laughs> Oh, he just got straight flattened. I meant the other one that just went to fly. Yeah. Wee. What's in the bunker? Well, I didn't kill you. Like, hey, they got to him before you did. That annoys me. Yeah, fucking kill stealers. What do we have here? Multiple contacts. Get down, you moron. Hi there. Liara's down, predictably. I'm about to be down. Yep. Did you... Did you improve that armor? Uh, might have? I don't remember. Because, you know... And you say, it's been a while since you brought her. <laughs> you make a point. Um, Unity, please. Thank you. Liara. She's wearing Mantis 5, but it could be better. <laughs> Way better. <laughs> Is this light armor? Apparently. Cerberus Skunk Works. Well, it looks good. Yeah. I wonder, can that's I wear saying this something shit? even though in this game that's kind of hit and miss. Yeah, I can wear this shit, and it's actually and it's better than what I'm wearing. Give me that. Give me that shit. Now you look like a medic. Eh, details, details. Bring it. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. Medical interface for. <laughs> I mean, health regen. Yeah, that that's actually a pretty good idea. Not that I think about it. Or just flat damage resist. Yeah, both are pretty good. Hmm. Shield recovery. Okay. How's Ash's armor? It's grade five. It's but it could I be better. More How much is Cerberus Skunkwork stuff do I have? Apparently quite a bit. Where did I get this? Where did I get oh. this? Don't ask me. Yeah, it's literally uh, Black Ops gear. Huh. Is this, is this just... Th that's light armor. Bullshit. At some point, you should probably go back to the Citadel and 
use some of the massive amounts of money you've amassed. Dead. Oh, look, it's frozen. Oh, I forgot I could do this. Fuck you. Lara, what are you using? Lara, just use a damn pistol. <laughs> yeah, you notice up at the top it actually says she's untrained in everything except the pistol. I can't really see where it says she's on training, but um, that's it's top, top right. Oh, right. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Which reminds me, I can probably improve her pistol at this point. Probably. Oh, or maybe. not. Oh, there we go. Cerberus, of yes. course. <laughs> where did you get out of that stuff? Fucking Cerberus. Oh, wait, Cerberus. Cerberus. Oh, right, the armor we got was probably also from Cerberus. Yeah, it is Cerberus Skunk Works. Yeah, yeah, that. That'll. F Let me guess. I've also got a Cerberus assault rifle in here somewhere. Probably. That would probably explain where you got all of that no. stuff. No. Oh, that's a nice assault rifle for Ash. And oh god, she's still using Grade One AP rounds. <coughs> Give her some proton rounds. Yeah, that's upgrading. the bane of this game right right here. We're trying to remember to upgrade all this shit. Yeah. <coughs> what if I read some white the uh, changes when the following games were so good? You're not fucking wrong. No, I've never I'm seen this armor before. Hmm. Uh it seems strangely often that every time we play something together that you play way too many times before I inevitably end up helping you find something you have never seen before. I'll take it. Yeah? You're also dead. I didn't kill you. This is Stay back! I've got no grief with you. All I want is this bastard. Please! He's a madman! Mr. Toombs, you're insane! You need help! It's Corporal! Corporal Toombs! You don't get to lie! Not today! Today it all comes out! What are you talking about? Why do you want to kill this man? Want? What I want is my life back. I... I want to go to sleep without screaming in my dreams! I want the people who sent me to Akuz brought to justice! Can't you see that Tombs is crazy? Shoot him! But if I can't get that, I'll have to settle for killing the men who took my life away. What did the doctor do to you, Corporal? We were on a coos. When the Thresher Maws hit, my entire unit was wiped out. The Thresher Maws. The scientists were studying them. They let them hit our unit just to watch. I woke up in a holding cell. The scientists were delighted I'd survive. Now they had someone to run tests on. What kind of tests are we talking about? You can't believe Toombs. He doesn't have any proof. I demand a fair trial. Ever had Thresher Ma acid in your veins? I have. They wanted to see what it would do. They treated me like a lab animal. I only escaped because somebody destroyed Cerberus, <coughs> a big organization. Oh, of course. Someone, huh? Deserves to die. So, are you going to kill me or not? You're better than this, Tombs. You're not like them. Don't tell me what I am. Nobody knows who I am. Those bastards took it all away. They ran their tests until I screamed. Until I cried. I couldn't remember my own name half the time. I should be dead, like my unit. I'm nothing. Why am I too good to murder him? Think of your friends who died on a coos. Would they want revenge or justice? 
Hadn't thought of it like that. That was fast. Okay. I mean, you kind of still had a murderer, but you know. Yeah, well. They couldn't make me one. Just as long as he goes to trial. Maybe the screaming will stop now. I don't know. Oof. Yeah, that's... Uh... Those bastards can't hurt you anymore. Joker, tell the 5th Fleet we need a ship for pickup. Aye, aye, Commander. Tomb stares morosely at the floor, lost in his memories. You give the scientists a shove towards the door, your mission complete. The Alliance courts will take it from here. It was Cerberus. A yep. fucking course it was Cerberus. You must die. Why you had uh, the mission before. Use you. <laughs> yeah, you kinda missed one. Bitch. Uh, are you alright? Listen, she interrupted us. Yes. Message coming in. Patching it through. I reviewed your report on the situation, Commander. I'm glad to see you were able to take Dr. Wayne in alive. Now we can put him on trial and get some answers. Corporal Toon seems to have found some closure, hopefully with therapy. He'll have a normal life again someday. Thank you again for your assistance, Commander. Yeah, that's a. Uh, yeah. Hopefully, he'll get better. The moral of the story is Cerberus is a bunch of fucking cunts. Yeah. Good thing we killed them all. Oh, most of them, at least. Asteroid X-35. That's awful close to the planet, ain't it? Yes. That's, uh... It's very close. A metallic asteroid originally located at the trailing Lagrange point of the gas giant bore. With the increased development on Terra Nova, a new orbital port facility was necessary. Due to a shortage of funding, it was decided to mine out X-57, X using the recovered resources to finish out the interior for habitation. The asteroid was decelerated from Bohr's orbit using fusion torches, allowing it to fall into orbit of Terra Nova. Recently, communications with the engineering team on X-57 have been lost. The fusion torches have reignited, and the asteroid is accelerating towards Terra Nova. That's not good, to say the least. You already know why this DLC is called Bring Down the Sky. Yeah. The sky is falling down. Mmm. Um, yeah, I don't Garrus, why not? Sure, I'm a nice balanced squad. Yeah. Return to Normandy is still an option anyway. <laughs> yeah, in case you want to be that much of a cunt. I wonder if there's an actual time behind it. Hmm. Mm -hmm. It doesn't show this one on the map. Oh. See, it, see it on my mini map? Huh. And I have no idea, I've never been dumb enough to take four hours doing this. <coughs> I don't know. Sick. Body of G. Mendel. 
The victim was badly beaten before being killed with a pistol shot to the back of the head at close range. It's likely he surrendered, only to be executed by his sadistic captors. Yeah. Locked. G. Mendo. Central transmission tower is on to Fritz again. No one ever listened to my warnings about sim single points of failure. I'm surprised our surface comms work half as well as they do. When Slash shows up to relieve me, I'll go see if I can get the old girl back up and running. So that tells me none of that ever happened. Um. <laughs> so, let's place our bets. Who's up to no good today? Um. Could be the gate. Would be salty aliens. I doubt it's the Geth. The Geth don't have need to beat and torture. Yeah, good point. Inefficient, and illogical. It, yeah, it'd be a husk if they have. Exactly. So it's probably one of the two alien factions that really, really, really hate the humans. I mean, I know the Batarians don't like humans. Don't th I can't think of another one that really hates us. Uh, eh, some of, some of Garros' race. Yeah, Tur yeah, Turians don't really like them. Yeah, yeah like, not the entire race, but there's uh, enough of... Uh, there's enough Turians that don't like humanity in to count. To try, and, to try and commit a war crime? I mean, don't need that many people to really put an operation like this. Especially if it's not official. Mm, I guess. Moving out. Well, let's find out, shall we? Mm-hmm. Got this plane that is working. We should really try that again at some point. I don't know. Come in. Knock knock. Not that Wilson is completely up the fucking list because. Oh, uh, yep, yeah, it's Batarians. Batarians. Yep. Rock! Check! Check! Yeah, I have a Oh, so you wanted to make me move a sabotage, I think. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that doesn't get old. Oh, that makes me wonder. Does Garrus have some armor he can use? No. I guess Cerberus wouldn't design Turian armor. Probably freaking not. Yeah, I could have hoped. Well, let me check his weapon at least. That might help oh. He actually already has a Cerberus weapon. <coughs> Release yeah. the Baron! There I you guess go. you can like, give it to him instead of the Well, I mean, I've got a Spectre weapon, so... Yeah, yeah, just like that. Yeah, that's what he didn't y'all do that already? Area secure then. For now. Yeah. We do have quite a bit of area to secure after all. Shit. God damn it! Give me the loot. You should probably work on your page and stuff. Shut up. Nope. Send the torches offline. Was that you? Can you hear me? I hear you. What's going on? Who are you? My name's Kate Bowman. I'm an engineer. I was part of the team assigned to bring this asteroid to Terra Nova. We were attacked yesterday by Batarian extremists. I've been hiding since they arrived. 
think they know the torch went out. Stay put. I'll get those other torches offline as soon as I can. Thanks. I'll contact you when I can. Okay. Well, time to just go find the other two, I guess. Pretty much. How's the time, by the way? We've been doing this for a while. Mm, we're good. Okay. Hey. I'm not going to be like that. Oh, God. Bruh. I didn't mean to. Are you hurt? Takes more than that one shot to bring me down. Sorry. I didn't not even sure. realize you were human until. Well, I guess I'm not much of a soldier. I know you're scared, but I'm here to help. Commander Shepard with the Alliance. Simon. Simon Atwell. I'm the chief engineer on this rock. Listen, we don't have much time. The Batarians fired up the fusion torches. You've got to shut them down before we hit Terra Nova. There yes, are we know! People down there, Shepard. I. My family. They live in Aronis. My kids and grandkids. Nice community. Good schools. I don't have time to do the math in my head. What happens if we don't stop this? X-57 is 22 kilometers long, twice the size of the asteroid that wiped out the Earth's dinosaurs. It would be like millions of fusion bombs striking at once. Millions. The heat of the blast. A thousand kilometers away, clothes will ignite. There'll be global wildfires. Air shock will flatten everything for hundreds of kilometers. Terra Nova will die, Shepard. Not just our colony. The planet. There'll be a climate shift, mass extinctions. The ecosystem won't recover for thousands of years. Millions, maybe. Is there any chance it'll land in the oceans? That would be even worse. Tsunamis would sweep inland at hundreds of kilometers per hour. Millions of tons of water would be vaporized at the point of impact. Global cloud coverage. The plants could all die, and if they go, the whole ecosystem rolls over. I'd have to run the numbers, but take my word for it. It'd be bad. This doesn't make any sense. Batarians run criminal games. Unethical, but profitable. They don't destroy worlds. What is this game, though? I've heard all the stories. Slave rings ranching people like animals. Pirate bands burning colonies to the ground. But this is... The Citadel Conventions forbid asteroid drops. I never thought the Batarians would go this far. Most Batarians aren't genocidal madmen. But these ones are terrorists. Yeah, I know. It's just... This isn't how I expected the world to be when I rolled out of bed this morning. Batarians everywhere, and I need no to shit. shut down all three torches. <laughs> Anything else I should know? One of the torches is surrounded by live blasting caps. We were set up to excavate when we arrived at Terra Nova. I rigged them with proximity detectors. That tank of yours will set them off, so you'll have to go in on foot. Even then, they'll explode if you get too close. Just go slow and easy. You should be fine. Time's running short. One last thing. I had a crew working off-site when the attack hit. I'm worried about them. These yeah, batarians are ruthless. I saw them smash the faceplates of guys working vacuum. And those Varen. I don't think they always wait for a corpse before feeding. I came across a member of your crew. He didn't make it. I... I see. Well, maybe the other two are still out there. You never know. There were a bunch of engineers over at the main facility, but they're probably all dead. That are being held hostage by the Batarians. A woman named Kate Bowman contacted me. The Batarians haven't found her yet. Katie's alive. She's one of my best engineers. She signed on with her brother, Aaron, I think his name is. He's part of the security detail. I hope they're okay. You'd better find a good place to hide. If the Batarians come back and find you. Yeah. I think I'll make myself scarce. Good luck, Shepard. Right, Find engineers, turn off the torches. Seems yep. easy enough. Two people to rescue, two people to rescue, two devices to blow up. And a bunch of aliens to kill. Yep. Easy enough. Sounds like a normal Tuesday to me. Wait, it's technically not eh, Actually, no, it's the same. It's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. Or whatever day it is. Anyway, we'll get back to that next time. Bye.